Were you always aware that the celebrity that you always enjoyed as a corporate leader, uh, there was some extra scrutiny attached to it because you were a woman? I mean, uh, was that something which always followed you? Uh, I sadly would, you know, say yes. But I think that scrutiny starts very early in our careers as women. Uh, I know that in the days when I was at Grinley's Bank, one of the first few women in the early 80s, and I think for all of us women who embarked on our careers at that time, we felt like goldfish in a bowl. You always felt you were on display. Uh, there were people just waiting to see you fall and say, oh, see, you know, this is what it was about. For every woman who took maternity leave, it, uh, I think, was another slight for all womankind. And I was very conscious of the fact, and therefore under a lot of pressure personally, uh, that for everything that I did, it was, uh, that, and if it turned out wrong, it was not just a blot against me and my career, but possibly for all women that were following. And that puts one under immense pressure. I don't think that has gone away completely because, you know, we still, sadly, still uh, represent other women, not just ourselves as individuals in our careers as we go. So that pressure is something one just gets to used to, you know, living with and being with. And uh, yes, I do fear that that scrutiny never ends. When you fall, you are noticed much more. When you succeed, fortunately, that too gets noticed, and uh, so it works both ways. If you like the video, do like, comment, share, and subscribe.